Okay, guys and girls, welcome to the stream. Here we go. Tonight's final matchup finally taking place from the first season, the test season. So the rules are a little bit iffy. But here we go. We've got Revelation Esports versus Imperial Esports. EMP will just check the team colors here. I think we got it right. I think we got red in the blue here. EMP red. We will double check. We're on Suez tonight, guys and girls, for the first map here. Lovely, dirty little map that this one is. I don't know. The teams love it. They love it. They really do. It's such such a chaotic hellhole down at Bravo. It's good, good fun. Good for the drive and the adrenaline. Yeah, welcome in. It'll be nice to finally put this league to bed. Let me tell you that for sure. Okay, so EMP in red and Rev in the blue. Here we go. Let's get up on that camera and take a little look at what's happening down here. So, Revelation pushing aim and impasse straight up onto Charlie. And we see Blink making his way down to Apples there. So, EMP got the good spawn this side. They got the Charlie Bravo flag straight away. And already putting pressure down on Apples now. Revelation Blink on his own. Kukai Cash moving in. So, let's get down here and have a little look. There's a Revelation straight away on the back foot with a triple cap there. Just a small one. But they are now forced on the apple spawn. We've got Lawrence now making their way on the outside. If he'll make it or not is another question. Cash left down here on apples on his own now. EMP holding out pretty well though. It's good now then apples. By revelation but not holding it very long. I just got Cortec and is it Baker? Baskar? Moving straight in there. Okay so Lawrence made his way around to Charlie. That's nice. Gonna give Revelation that little break's gonna pull some of the EMP guys back off the flags here. The Revelation to come around the backside. You've got XCOM now on the inside. Bravo coming up against Dom. I don't know if the walls will come down. We'll get a little look inside there too. Okay, so Revelation, um, yeah, they're on a bit of a back foot there with EMP the taking a big strong lead though. 21 and 4 on the ticket count. Like a slow start there for Revelation for sure. Now they are holding the flags, doing well here to hold it out. Uh, Charlie, sorry, uh, Bravo. All take just uh, clinging on for his dear life there with Lawrence here now. Bukai spawning in. Then we've got EMP trying to make that push round to Charlie here then, so nice there. Uh, Lawrence there taking out Cortec. Has taken out Kukai from behind. The EMP now on the back flag on the Apple's flag. A nice roll reversal there, so the ticket gap is closing up a little bit. Back in favour with uh, Rev. So not too much damage on the ticket count there for those guys. Looking pretty strong at the minute. They've got EMP locked down at the minute at Apple's. I haven't seen a break off the flag yet. Got Cash making a little push through. Kukai on the spawn, making that breakthrough now for Charlie. Let's have a look, see if he makes it through. Got Xcom coming up behind him. Okay, right there by Kukai. Now in on Bravo. Small little triple cap there, he's brought the tickets up. We're nearly 10 ahead now for Revelation. Yeah, very up and down game. This is what we expect in the finals, guys. We don't expect it to be one sided at all. We expect it to be up and down like this. This is good. Good play from both teams so far from what I've seen. We're going to get down in a minute and have a little look at the players and see who's running what. There we go. We've got we to take on board the revelation aim as he makes his push then up to Charlie. Revelation name going down there by EMP Cash. I remember why I don't like the third person cam. We get a lot of death cam. I don't like the death cam. I like to see what's happening. It's good to get down. See what's happening there. So the tickets then. 42 and 34 then with Revelation at the minute. But the flags, they were slightly in favour with EMP there. But EMP looked like they've got a little bit of work on their hands now. Got some little mini fights going on. We've got a best car here. Having a little fight from the deployment with Link. Cash and Cortex coming up in Apples. Yeah, 
nice close down there by Revelation, moving in for that triple yet again. EMP, I haven't seen them in this position yet so far. I don't think many teams have put them in this position throughout the league that we've seen. But here we go, they seem rather static. I don't know what's... There doesn't seem to be much of a push from what I'm watching and what I'm seeing at EMP. They're, they're not... They don't seem to be moving as quickly as I've seen them previously. They're playing rather passive at the minute. But Cortec making his way down through the inside, trying to get onto Apples. Revelation doing a good job of holding down those alleyways, but Cortec got through. Here we go, we'll need Cortec on Apples at the minute. Here comes Charlie. Okay, so yeah, EMP with three guys on Charlie here. Two guy in the middle of Bravo on his own. It's never a good scenario to end well when you're on your own, you've got multiple enemies. Here we go, Revelation keeping hold of Apples now. Apple and Bravo now secure. Cash, Ascar and Cortec. Kuka inside Bravo now. Trying to get that burn on to EMP. 62-42 Revelation. Pretty strong lead at the minute. 20 tickets, that's good for those guys. That's a good strong position to be in. But like we said, we've seen it a million times on this game mode. It can change with just one flag going at the right time. Quite a varied map, quite a bit of fighting going across the map at the minute. Kukai and Cortec pushing in onto Charlie then for EMP. We've got XCOM bending from the upstairs. And Lauren's now moving in. Here, 66 and 47 for sure. It's, uh, the gap's closing a little bit here. EMP looking to make a little triple at the minute. We've got a little standoff here at Charlie. We've got a little one down at Apples. If you can just see it up in the top corner there. Revelation pushing four guys into Apples then. They're very backwards and forwards. Both teams now at opposite ends of the map from one another. Going to both meet up in Bravo for a little exchange, I should imagine. Full tech there taking down aim. Good work through the window. Nice impasse there, get the double kill there with Cortec and Dom. EMP and nice secure and bravo for Revelation 68 59. So the ticket's closing up a little bit. But still quite quite good in favour there with Revelation. Wow. Very, very close game indeed, guys. It's still anybody's on this round if you ask me. But EMP making work now for that triple again at Apples. Kukai working the inside, Revelation, Amix, Calm, Lawrence. Small push now from Blink going round to Charlie. Yeah, Rev guy's doing well to hold on the inside there. Cleared out Apple, sorry. Cash still lurking around, waiting for those members to spawn and get back in on the flag. Nobody was aware of that position though. That, that little plan didn't work out too well for the EMP guys. Absolutely there. Here we go, back in on Bravo now then. 74, 69, so five tickets in it, guys and girls. It's really anybody's at the minute. EMP, from what I've seen and so far, they, they definitely do not want to be losing this one. But so far, they're on flawless, flawless wins throughout the competition, so definitely some good teams here. for the last few tickets here we've got Revolution England with 17 kills and 13 deaths running with everybody's favourite medic weapon there the auto loading extended we are losing objective button. check guys we've got Lawrence here now making that push for apples we have lost objective butter nice objective yeah so far pretty even field this the MP have took over now, we've got a small ticket lead of three tickets, but three tickets isn't a lot in this game. We've got Lawrence there capturing apples back then so far. No contest. So the flags again back in favour with Revelation then. Yeah, we follow Revelation aim in here as he makes a push on Bravo. Oh he walks straight into that one from Baskar for EMP. Here we go, we've got Kukai keeping hold of Charlie. Dom and Cortec pushing round. 
the GMP going to try for that triple again? Are they going to try and get Cortec in on the flag at the minute? He's got that clean break. He's got the clean break at the minute. Apple's undefended at the moment. He's in. The flag is now burning. Can the EMP guys keep Rev busy enough on Bravo to allow Cortex to do that triple? Lawrence now sprawling in. Might put a stop to that. Oh well, yeah, Lawrence there taking down Cortex, moving in then with its your apples. Okay, 90-84 guys and girls, very very close indeed. It, it really anybody still at this minute in time, EMP making that push on apples and they, they definitely want to get that third flag. Um, Revelation not allowing that at the moment. Okay, so we've got aim. Come pushing in on Bravo now. Cortex got himself in a crossfire there with Lawrence and Revelation Amy wasn't going to go down too well crossing that street. Here we go, 95 86. This round looks like it could be going with EMP. Okay, last few tickets of the round now, guys and girls. All the action's happening down in on Charlie then. Very difficult with the buildings in the way. You see what's happening sometimes. We've got Impas there taking out Dom. All goes that last scramble. Now we've got Revelation looking strong on the flag zone. They're clearing out Charlie. They're going to get that little triple right at the end. They could snatch the round here, guys and girls. There's no movement off that Charlie flag. This round is definitely 100% going to go to Revelation. Just at the end, snatched it. Just at the end, snatched it. So. That was good, 100 to 95. Wow, so. That was good. That was good, huh? <laughs> 100 to 95 then to Revelation on the first round. That was some close, close stuff. Some close, close stuff. I almost thought it was in the bag there for EMP, but you should never call it, really. It's, it's good to never call it. Well done there to Revelation taking the first round win, putting them that one step closer to what's been the winners of the final. The first ESL T5 domination winners will be announced tonight. Revelation have just got themselves one step closer to that, so GG to those guys so far. Sweet, so we check the scoreboard out. Nice, and we see 195 then. Revelation. MP. Good round, very close stuff, very close stuff. It's hard to call it when they're these close. It is definitely hard to call it when they are these close. Yeah, absolutely good. Good. Good play. I can't wait to see the second round now. Obviously, we're going to switch teams. The MP did have the strongest spawn there, in my opinion. Obviously, all speculation. But, in my opinion, they had the strongest spawn there getting Charlie and Bravo quick. But... Let's get back into it. Okay. So we're going to be switched up. Nice. Here we go, guys and girls. Second round then of the final. Essentially, Imperial Esports, they need to win this round. Keep it on that level peg to keep that opportunity alive, I would call it. Yeah, let's do this, man. Let's get in there. We got them fucking, excuse me, we got the five seconds on the clock. <laughs> so Revelation will be in red. EMP will be in the blue. And uh, let's get down and see what happens here. So we've got Baskar, Cortex pushes straight up on Charlie, we've got Revelation A straight away in a good defensive position there with Impas blocking down that alleyway. And Kukai Cash pushing down to Apples then. So here we go, we've got Rev with a good spawn, they've got Charlie Bravo secure, the work is on EMP. They have a standstill happening up with Charlie with Cortex, Baskar didn't make it in. Being held back a little bit at the moment by Impas. Cortex runs straight past there, allowing himself. Get shot in the back there by Impas on the inside of Charlie. That's going to make him that push on the inside. Dom spawning. Let's get down on Bravo and have a little look. Those guys are going to have a little bit of exchanging inside Charlie. 
but it's all going down up here so we're gonna go jump on with some players actually for this round we're gonna go see what's happening here so we have taken objective here we go. Kai. aka squiggy on twitch he may be streaming you may want to go and check him out but here he is running with the bar storm two kills not died yet on this field Goes inside. Oh, and he was taken out by the rocket gun there by we Revelation Impass. Apples. We'll get back on the player cams in a little bit. Get down onto Apples. You miss a lot of action being on one person. Nice to see what's happening in the game here, especially in the final match. Good to see what these guys are doing. Nice. So EMP here on Apples there. They've got a hold of Charlie's Revelations inside on Bravo at the minute. Making that push down into Apples now. Ash was there waiting, unfortunately. Yeah, tickets very even at the minute. You've got Dom and XCOM on the inside. Depending who wins this trade off, it could be the start of a small triple here for EMP. So Dom now on the inside. Charlie burning down. Nope. Charlie, Charlie was saved the day there. Revelation aim camping that. Both teams putting a lot of gunpowder now into this Bravo here. Inside a little better, it'd be nice. Oh, it went a little bit eerily quiet there for a second. There was no gunfire, so a lot of people on screen, but it all just went a little bit quiet. So we've got Lawrence now for Rev making that push. Poor Apples, unfortunately, Kukai stopped him in his tracks. And he's now making that push up to support his team on Bravo, which Revelation were currently about to capture, but they pushed the guys off the flag, which allowed Dom there to stay on and keep it in favour there with EMP slightly. Those moments where it all goes quiet, it gets a little bit... A little bit eerie. There you go, we've got Impaz now coming around the outside of Kukai. Revelation keeping him busy. It's going to allow him round on the flank. The yeah, Impaz are one in trouble now. Kukai and Don coming around the app for sure. EMP yeah, securing apples. That's going to be a triple cap going girls. Revelation going to make that push off this back spawn now. Into Charlie, into Bravo. Little tiny triple, there was about five or six tickets bled on that one there, which was... It, 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 every little helps, as they say. Very good exchanges of the flags here. Up and down, up and down for both teams. Neither team willing to let the other have them at the minute. All the fighting at the minute inside Bravo. Then we've got Pascal, Cortex, the EMP. Bravo now secured. Revelation Lauren and Aim not too far away. Aim making that push then through to Bro Apples. As quick as he's on there. We've got the guys on Charlie here from EMP. Revelation Blink. Bit of a dangerous spot at the minute. Two guy and Cortex coming around from either side. Cortex taking the kill then. Yeah, now it's down to cash at the minute to keep these guys busy on Apples. To allow the rest of his team to push up, and then he'll get the triple for sure. Not sure Cash can manage it here at the minute. He's way outnumbered, but here we go. He's down. Just as the rest of the team starts to get into position. It's a, it's a good position for EMP at the minute with 48 30, so nearly 20 ticket lead at the minute. Come down. Just trying to keep an eye. Make sure he gets in on Charlie, and he does so. So we could have a little triple here then for Revelation. We've got Bastard, Cortex coming in for EMP. Can they get inside quick enough? Then we've got Cortex there taking down Lawrence. It's a comp left for Rev then on the inside going down. Kukai taking him out, stopping that triple cap just in time. Really, cash now on Apples. Uh, 
there. You, 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 you feel a little bit sorry for the guy that gets sent to cap the flag and do do the waiting bit. You, know? <laughs> you get found. It's like hunting. You know, like a squad hunt. There we go. Very quick pace game. This one. Both teams moving in and out of the flags quickly, not allowing either one in or out. Not allowing any team to hold them for lengthy periods of time, so it's good at the minute. Revelation looking strong now though, with the MP pushed back on the Charlie flag. Revelation can lock this down now, they could close that ticket gap a little bit. We've got Lawrence there on one flank, Ixcov was on one flank, but he's come down now, we've got Blink behind Ixcov there, waiting for the second wave, I say we'll call it. There's the revelation inside them with a Charlie. Okay, they're looking pretty strong at the minute. They need this triple really. If they can get this, it will give them a few tickets back. See, we've already got movement from cash down on apples or EMP. So 59.52. Yeah, that, that little small triple did the job. It brought the tickets up nice and close, and it keeps both teams in the game. Revelation again looking pretty strong here. They've got a nice little setup at the minute. They've got a lot of the alleyways and a lot of the, the choke points sort of closed down at the minute. Vortex sort of trying to make his way through. Unfortunately, they're you know, taken down there in the end by Revelation Aim. So EMP is still stuck on this Apple flag at the minute. Cortex can get round unspotted here now. He might get that break, but you see, we've got Lawrence from Rev just in a nice spot to come round behind and catch that second wave if they make it through. You can see the nice communication work there from the Revelation guys at the minute. EMP still stuck on this Apple's flag. They look like they're struggling to make any sort of push at the moment. Cortex nearly through their Dom. Dom through it, he's going to get in, he's inside on Bravo, nice work there for Dom. Is he going to survive long enough to do any damage to the flag? A okay, nice Vortex and Pascal then spawning in, so EMP getting that opportunity to burn Bravo now. Still happening down at Apple so we've got Lawrence here in Paz, Bukite. The 69-72. Tickets just ever so slightly in favour of Red then. Three ticket lead here. Yeah, it is all going down there. You both teams utilising the whole map here for sure. We've got fights happening across two, three flags sometimes. Yeah, so Ixkov standing still for Rev on the Apples flag, keeping that. And Balls Lauren is in the Bravo now. Getting that little small burn on then for Rev. Small opportunity for a triple cap there, but it was stopped by Bascar there moving in onto Charlie for EMP. Yeah, again, so, such a tough game to call. Such a tough game to call with both teams making quick exchanges like that. Guy in a lot of trouble there. He held out for a while using the what's that, like the mobile cannon trailer. Just cover there, but it, it can only last so long when you're lying down, I guess, and you've got three guys surrounding you. We've got to Charlie, and we approach the last final bit of the round eight. You've won 80. Small, small lead for Rev. Charlie then at the minute. Burn up, burning with cash outnumbered at the minute. He's outnumbered in a little bit of danger. You can see his health slow. Trying to get medded up, but he's being hunted at the moment. Okay, 85, 83 then. Two flags to Revelation. Cash is like the last hope at the minute for EMP to keep this Charlie flag. 
work here. Okay, nice. Did good enough to get the guy spawned in, so Charlie's gonna go back to the possession of EMP. EMP can get that little push in on Bravo. Now the game can change again completely. It is literally one of those. Again, we see as soon as EMP get that break revelation in, they close it down again by securing apples. EMP straight away in on Bravo. I mean, it depends how quick they can move off of this now. They didn't secure Bravo. They, they, they looks like they've decided to make that push to try and keep Revelation off of Bravo. Uh, Apples, but it might not have worked. They pushed maybe too many players forward. But yeah, Rev have got that breakthrough to Charlie. Definitely still anybody's game, I guess. 93 and 90 at the minute then. Wow. Here we go, guys and girls. Revelation securing Bravo. If EMP, is, uh, they're definitely trying to work that triple. They, they secured themselves at Charlie. So they can get inside now on Bravo. Just get that flag burning. It could definitely just, like we've just seen in the last round, literally just turn it round by five tickets. It might be enough. I don't think they've got the manpower on Charlie to stop the burn there. But they have got that one ticket lead now, so it's getting a little bit exciting this end. Here we go, so two flags for EMP, one for Revelation, 97 to 95. Eee, it's getting close guys and girls, it is getting close. EMP guys just throwing everything they have at Charlie at the minute there with the rockets. Okay, nice. So... 197 at uh, EMP. Wow. Good stuff, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's real good stuff. Real close round, so that's one round apiece. That's good. Both teams go through feeling confident. Yeah, good stuff, man. Good stuff. One round apiece. And now we can see the there we, we seem to have dropped a player there we are going on to Amiens next which is nice nice Amiens always good for a little bit of domination on Amiens Maybe seeing ourselves a deciding round tonight, guys and girls, which will be on Argon Forest if we make it there. That depends on the teams now and these next two rounds. Does look like we are player short still. We'll see. We'll see. Switch this round. MP in blue, was it? Got the MP in blue. Yeah. Revelation in the red. Here we go. Revelation. They are playing down at the minute. And here we go, just in time. He made it just in time there, guys and girls. Into Amiens then. We've just checked. Nope, we've got Rev in the blue. There we go. Nice, straight down then. Into the alleyways of Amiens. We've got Lawrence Rev then pushing straight in onto Charlie. So Revelation in again. In my opinion, they got the good spawn allowing them to get that quick break onto Charlie. Okay, it looks like EMP looking to play this a little bit from the inside on the alleyways here, not being too aggressive on the push to Charlie. There is a little break there for Cash now if he wants to take it. Fortunately, the alleyway was locked down. Okay, 
Okay, good work. Go jump down on board with some guys now. Okay. Okay, there we go. So we have on board then with VMP cash. Three kills already. Nice, good head start for this stage in the game. He's run with the all over extended. Every medic's favourite done. Pascal, unfortunately, going down we just as we switch. Battles. Revelation Blink there, taking him out. We have taken objective also, running with the auto loading extended here as he makes a push up on Charlie. Oh, dear lord, I've gone inside the house. There we go. We get back up. Get back up where we can see what's happening here. Cash then for EMP, looking to defend Charlie at the moment. Let's see if he's aware of Lawrence coming around from behind. Yeah, Lawrence taking the kill there on Cash, getting that secure then on Charlie. This could be a small triple then for Revelation Esports. Just a small one, Bravo currently burning as well. But these small triples, they all add up, they can make it. Unfortunately, Bravo went quicker than... Charlie, it's not going to do too much significant damage there, but the ticket smallly then for Revelation with 18, 16, and the MP. Revelation look, looking strong then as they push forward then onto Bravo. Bravo at the minute from what I can see, not a lot of defense here, we've got Kukai just spawning in it. He doesn't get some support, there we go, we've got some support then from Cash. Okay, nice clean up there, Kukai. Cool Cash working on XCOM Revelation Impads. And a good clean up and good secure there by EMP. The Apple Zen. Bascar here, Cortec. The Revelation Impads then. Aim coming from behind. Only a matter of time for Bascar went down there, he was in a little bit of a pickle. We got Revelation then securing apples. Cortex straight away on the spawn note. Very passive there from EMP players. Good work though, and that is a triple tap on the horizon then for EMP. Could be a dangerous spot here. We've got Revelation aim, blink, impas. Xcov, all spawned in there, no apples. Nice clean up there. Stopped that triple pretty early in its track, so that's going to be good. But now it's going to be a push for these guys to get themselves off the A flag. Got Donald Cash. Holding down at Charlie's side. Okay. Impaz and Lawrence make the push them onto Bravo. Going down there by Bukai, I believe. Yeah. Okay, so back to Apple's end with the revelation on that A spawn. Got a break at Charlie. So far, undefended. No contest at the minute. Then revelation aim on the inside. We've got Bascar for EMP coming up now from Bravo. Just a minute, little one v one at the minute. Okay, revelation aim doing well, holding down his position there. Okay, both teams have got themselves into one of those loops where they, they, they miss each other, I think. Apart from Lawrence here, Lawrence doing well at the minute. Taken down, double kill so far with Don Baskar. Yeah, there's another one there for Lawrence, taking Dom again. And another one there, taking Baskar there, so... There they are, we've just seen four kills there from Lawrence. Kukai doing a very good job at hiding there. That, that was very stealthy work there from Kukai. Unfortunately, he didn't finish off Lawrence, but one more bullet should do the job. And there it goes, Kukai. That was that was a beautiful little hiding hole. <laughs> awesome source. Okay, Kukai going strong now then with a triple kill then. 
Good stuff. The rolls have reversed. Good fight with the minute centralised round. Bravo. EMP holding apples and Charlie. Okay, so now they've got that break off of Bravo now. That was going to send Lawrence and Ixkov up towards Charlie then. MP Baskar on the other side. Unfortunately there, Lawrence wasn't quite as ninja as he was at Bravo. Blink turn around there. On the outside, taking out Baskar. Okay, Rev in a good position then to move in on Charlie now. There we go. Well, so tickets 56 and 48, so very close game indeed. There's only six tickets in it, guys. So it's eight tickets, sorry. Bad maths. But yeah, very close, very close indeed. Flags are up and down. Revelation now securing Charlie. So we've got Dom, Cortec, Cash pushing in straight away. Very intense stuff, this is very close. Charlie, there we go, we've got a blink then for Revelation, he's going to do his best. Fortunately, just, just a case of too many weapons pointed at him in that situation. Revelation, Ixcob then inside Apples. Which way do we go? Looks like Charlie's going to get the action first. And yeah, be in a good position then at the moment to hold down Charlie and Bravo. Which is ideally where you want them if you, you know, the crossfires you can create on this map from holding. Well, I guess any two flags really on this map are good, but I prefer. Rather than Charlie's like a nice, nice one. You lock down these main streets and he's, you're pretty good. Okay, they're making that push, they want that triple. They want to get that ticket lead up a little bit, so here we go, we've got Baskar moving in then. Not going to be quite quick enough for the triple though, as we have impasse for Revelation on Charlie. Watch Discord waffle. Sorry, just replying to the teams here. There, it's been a while since they played this competition. We were um, we took a break before Christmas, so we're only just catching up now. I think some of them have forgotten the rules. <laughs> there you go, McCann. Sorry, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, basically yeah. So we one round. If you're here, if you're not listening. We're doing one round on the decider. We, we addressed the issue with it for the end of the season, but as it was the rules for the season, we have to finish with those rules. Um, so yeah, we're having one round on the decider on Argon Forest. For the guys that don't know, here we go. Revelation aim then holding apples pretty well there. Let's get back to the game, guys and girls. Dom at the minute still for EMP. Charlie then, Revelation looking to secure that and get themselves a triple cap and approach the end of the game then. Revelation could do with this triple cap then to close that ticket gap. It's 10 at the minute, 80 to 73. A little bit of damage there, not quite enough, but Lawrence is still surviving and he's still inside Charlie, looking good for Revelation. Clearing up inside Charlie. Still very, very close indeed. 82, 78. There's only four tickets in it. They are in favour with EMP at the moment. As we witnessed in the last two rounds, it can literally change in the last five tickets. So, yeah. We, we're not going to rule anything out yet. 
trying to look to see where that brake's coming from, see where the action is here. It's just inside these alleyways off Charlie at the moment. Revelation, I'm not sure if they're looking to defend these flags. There's no one on apples at the minute. Lauren's got quite a bit of run to catch up with Dom and Cortec here. 86, 84, very close stuff. Very, very, very close stuff. It's intense here as we approach the end of the third round then. The MP holding apples with Charlie. I'm gonna get up to Charlie, there's something happening over here. Revelation pushing quite strong there, quite aggressive then with Aim and Lawrence. Kukai not far behind them coming now. Yeah, unfortunately Lawrence made his way around the back there taking Kukai down as he was distracted there by Aim. Okay, so Rev now gonna look for that push now onto Apples for sure. Here they come, we've got XCOM, Aim. So that last push, 92, 90. Currently in favour with EMP by three tickets. But here we've got Lawrence now pushing down. As soon as he's made it here, we've got Charlie turned around then. Alright, guys and girls. EMP straight back in on Apples and not allowing that shot down here. Not yet, 96, 92 EMP. Clinging on for apples, We're not giving it up. Revelation, also not backing down. The cash doing well to stop that push then onto Bravo. Final push from Revelation then. Oh, GG, that round going to EMP then, guys and girls. Ninety-five again. Wow. So, one hundred ninety-five enter EMP. So EMP, if they win this next round, they will be the winners. They will be announced to find them. You know, the winners of the final. Revelation win this round, we will go through to one more round on Argon Forest to decide who walks away the champions. Yeah, very, very close games though from both teams. Uh, it's literally down to the last few tickets, it's the last crunch that's winning these rounds at the minute. But yeah, let's have a little look, man. Good stuff, good stuff. We are li literally going to the tickets on this, man. Real good. So one more round if EMP win. The next round they will be the final. They will win. That will be them. They will be the official winners. If Revelation win this round, we will go through to a decider. Interesting stuff. Definitely interesting stuff. Like I mentioned before, we have tweaked the photos if anyone's concerned about the way the ruling is. We have tweaked it a little bit for the next season, which is, seems a little bit more of a fairer outcome. Maybe still need a little bit of tweaking, but we are new, we're learning, so... Yes. Get ready then for the fourth round, guys and girls. Fourth and final round is about to happen. Good fun. Revelation in red, EMP in the blue. Let's have a look what these guys are going to do. Revelation there. On the back foot already, we've got Kukai pushed up straight away for EMP, securing Charlie now. Giving EMP that stronger advantage then, holding Apples and Charlie at the moment, got the two flag lead. 
pressure on then for Revelation, I guess, at this point. This is where they want to win this round. They want to be... They want to go through to a decider then to... Nobody wants to lose at this stage, do they? They want to go through. They want to fight till the end. But we'll see at the minute. Stuck on a little bit of, on the back foot of Bravo with Revelation at the minute. EMP. The spread's looking all right. Bar's getting ready to shut down Bravo. We've got the main street covered here, the main road at the bottom here. They've got the exit out to Bravo. They've got the tunnel through. And now we've got Dom looking to cover the outside. So yeah, Revelation on a bit of a back foot at the minute. Tickets 12 and 6. They're going to need that break off of this flag. Not sure they've made it yet. There's not seen any movement through yet. We've got a small bit. We've got through the tunnel, but I don't think they've made it through just yet. Double check. We have got all the players. Yeah, we have got all players on the map. Okay, Revelation. They've got that break then onto Apples here with X Dog. All about surviving for him, I guess, now. But you've got Cortec, Dom, Kukai. All moving in on his position at the minute. It was only a matter of time. The MP then with strong numbers then at Apples. Pulling all those numbers back there. So now Revelation though that little small break off of B here. We've got A then. Taking down Kukai. Vortec taking down Blink, leaving Aim on his own. In a little bit of an EMP sandwich at the minute. Here yeah, Cortec getting the kill in the end there, but impact impasse sorry and blink spawning back in just on time. There we go, Impaz making the push then. Got to get on there now, they've got to stop that triple. Yeah, it's uh, looking not so hot for Revelation at the minute with that triple cap. 37 and 13, the tickets are bleeding real, real fast now. There we go, 42 and 13, Revelation. Back on the hot press here at Bravo. We're going to try and get that push now. But here we go back to where they started, unfortunately. So 45 and 14. The MP looking really strong. They're playing a little bit more aggressive for sure. They've got these alleyways locked down. There's no... It's not looking good for Rip, but they have got a break. They've got Charlie. To the MP, they don't seem to be making no push there. It's looking like they want to keep him up on Charlie there. You see Cash Dom just sitting down, sitting back on the apples. I think they're just waiting for the Revelation guys to push off of Charlie. I think they may have a better plan for holding A and B. The Revelation aim got through relatively unscathed there though. He's now inside. Yo, evening Wayne Fistful. Wrong time, huh? What do you mean, men? How are you doing? Welcome to the stream, guys. Here we go, this is the fourth round. This could be the last round. It's looking good for EMP. They're pretty strong at the minute. I just see they're a couple of rounds up. But they are looking strong. Yeah, over to Bravo then. See the player in on Charlie there, so I think they all died. Here we go, we've got Lawrence X Cobb inside Bravo then for Rev. A little bit of a blood fest going down there. Revelation could turn the game around if they get this triple cap now. We'll see, we've got Blink here and Impairs on the Apple's flag. Not quite quick enough. As you can see, Dom Cortec for EMP on Charlie. They had a small opportunity for a triple there, but it was quickly closed down there by EMP. The ticket gap got a little bit smaller. 58 now and 30. But it's going to be a tough one for Rev to pull it back from here. We've seen three very close rounds so far going down to the last few tickets, but... This one's going to be a little bit tougher for Rev. I have to be honest. Here we go, EMP then securing Apples and Charlie. Revelation aim got that breakthrough onto Apples. I think Cash saw him there coming across the alleyway. Not sure, he may not have seen him. 
Well, they definitely seen him now. Okay, got aim here then. Holding his ground, in all fairness, down at Apples here. Taking down Bascar there. And secured it. Well done there for Revelation Aim. Still has a little bit of dancing to do here with Cash. Cash taking him down, unfortunately, though. He's called now on the flank here for Apples. Cash moves back in to secure. Sixty-eight and forty-one. It's definitely, definitely looks like a hard battle for Revelation. I mean, compared to what we've just watched, this this definitely looks like they're they're, they're just struggling that a little bit more. We've got Dom here now for EMP on the inside with Cortex, looking to secure apples to make that triple happen again. They've done it. They've cleared out the Revelation guys. Unfortunately, right now. This this could be the end. This this could spell disaster at the minute. The Revelation guys are quite far away from a flag. By the time they get onto that flag, it might just be too late. Let's see, we've got Cortec already on the inside, so we've got defensive happening down on Charlie now with Lawrence and Cortec facing off. 93 tickets, guys. 94. It's it's it goes to EMP, guys and girls. It goes to EMP. EMP. 142 Wow Wow That round just did not go as good as the other ones Unfortunately for Revelation they, they are the runner-up EMP Imperial Esports They are the first official Battlefield Super League's E5 domination champions as it were so well done to those guys absolutely awesome source guys and girls thank you very very much yeah nice overlay you like the overlay do you McCann thank you very much dude there you go there's your final scores GG to EMP they are the winners they are the finalists I hope they have enjoyed yourselves for sure. I hope you've enjoyed the season. Like we said, it was a test. It was a test from BSL. It was our first attempt at running leagues with so many teams and so many participants. We, we, we know that we can do it. Um, we hope we've got enough support now from the teams to launch our second leagues, which will be a little bit more active. We've got a lot more teams that are interested and stuff. So, everybody... Thank you all very much for watching the stream. We'll be back. We've got the dog fighting one v ones. They're they're a lot more popular than I imagined. They they're going really good. If you want to check some out, you can on YouTube, whatever. Thank you very much. Go check us out. Give us a like on Facebook. Give us a like or a sub on YouTube. Give us some love here in the channel. Whatever you do, keep it real. Keep it battlefield. We'll see you all again very soon.